Now, let's dive into Nextcloud Talk. Um, we'll start with the key features uh, in Nextcloud Talk and then have a look at the big improvements um, and new features in Hub9. So what is Nextcloud Talk? Um, Nextcloud Talk is a unique tool for chatting, video conferencing, webinar streaming, um, and even remote learning. It facilitates the discussions, running polls, um, sharing documents and media while streaming li live content uh, with an advanced presential tool set. Um, Nextcloud Talk keeps your audience engaged um, with reactions, um, hand raising and other interactive tools. Need to wrap up a call? Just ask AI to summarize your chat discussion or transcribe the recording. Of course, it's local and privacy first. Nextcloud Talk is often used for webinars and large conferences. Um, to support this, um, it offers a series of moderation tools um, or moderation features um, so you can manage and maintain a safe um, and healthy environment. Um, with Hub9, uh, you can also now ban uh, users permanently from, from a chat. We introduced a few improvements in Talk, um, like making it easier to find a smart speaker um, to insert all kinds of content, like uh, links or um, images. You can now also configure uh, call notifications to play on a second speaker for um, added convenience. We also worked on the mobile apps for Nextcloud Talk. They have all the features we love and use in the web version of Talk. Um, in this release, we've also improved the offline functionality um, now, even with a poor network connection, um, you can still view chats and reply to messages, which will be sent once you're back online. We're ahead of the curve, uh, even when it means embracing innovative technology. With this mindset, we've developed an Apple Vision Pro app for Nextcloud, allowing you to experience your meetings in a fully immersive virtual environment. It means um, you can open the Nextcloud Talk um, app on the Vision Pro and organize there your calls, um, you know, um, participate in conversations, placing the window in your environment whenever you like. And we'll bring this also to other platforms. So stay tuned. Just like everything in Nextcloud Hub, Nextcloud Talk is highly scalable serving large group, um, groups of concurrent users uh, with chatting, attending webinars and participating in calls at the same time. Um, and what if you are a governmental um, agency? You likely prefer to chat with people in one place um, without creating a new account every time. So we made it possible um, even across separate uh, Nextcloud hubs. Frank already mentioned um, earlier in our presentation, uh, the Federation and we've seen how it works um, in Nextcloud files. And now let's have a look um, on how um, it works in Nextcloud Talk. You can count on Talk to keep decentralized teams connected, uh, whether you're collaborating with regional affiliates across uh, company branches on different continents or even partners who use Nextcloud. Um, with Federation, um, people from, for example, a um, governmental um, agency can jo join group chats on another server using their federated ID, uh, enabling them to chat, um, use the familiar tools um, like user mentions, chat commands, and um, even polls. So a federated setup is ideal uh, for collaborating between companies while ensuring that your data stays you know, private and secure within um, the company's network. With Nextcloud Hub, um, we bring you federated calls. This feature enables audio and video meetings um, among people from different clouds. Each user can access a call from their own web or mobile interface using their own account. So no guest users or public links, just a seamless experience. It feels just like a regular cloud meeting platform, doesn't it? But that's the beauty of federation. It gives you uh, that familiar experience while still being decentralized and keeping things local. Um, our federation is built on existing standards. The Open Cloud Mesh API is an open standard we collaborated on uh, with multiple organizations, among others, uh, the Research Institute CERN. And here you have all the new features of Nextcloud Talk um, summarized. Um, my favorite is Apple Vision Pro app. 
this brings your meetings um, to an entire um, a new experience. We are introducing a new app called Nextcloud Whiteboard. This is a canvas-like whiteboard for sketching, um, planning, and brainstorming that integrates well with your apps in Nextcloud Hub. Whether you're brainstorming ideas, planning projects, or collaborating with your team, Whiteboard offers an intuitive and interactive space to bring your ideas to life. Nextcloud Whiteboard is easy to use and scales along with your Nextcloud environment, ready to become your team's daily collaboration tool. Um, start a new whiteboard from um, the creation menu in Nextcode files, like any other file, um, or use the plus icon if you're using Nextcode Talk to create a um, whiteboard within your call or chat. You can draw with custom colors, strokes, presets, you can add stickers and shapes, you can use blocks and arrows, and even add your own images. You can present your ideas and thoughts to others using the laser point feature. Nextcloud Whiteboard can be adjusted to your own personal preferences with customization options, um, and we also support dark and light mode. When you build something worth keeping, of course, you can export it um, as an image or a PDF. You can draw a simple sketch um, or notes for your next team sync or visualize an entire com complex project. With an infinite canvas, um, you have all the space you need to discuss ideas um, and you can go as far as you want them to. You can invite others to participate um, to, um, to your canvas or whiteboard um, via Nextcloud files um, with your team or with external users, um, even if they don't have a Nextcloud account. All right, and here is the quick summary of the whiteboard features. Um, you can see all the, uh, the, new, the features we brought um, on the slide. And my favorite is um, using the different shapes. Um, so you can add or have the variety for different designs, for example.